Hey, what's up guys? How's everyone doing today? Hope everyone's having a great day. Hope everyone's having a great start to their morning after they see this video. Um, I told you guys we we're gonna be back. Um, you know, something I didn't talk to you guys about in the last video is, you know, you guys know that Jesse no longer works for us. You know, he has been working for us for the longest time. You know, make a lot more money, you know, owning his own construction business. If you guys wanna please go show him some love and go check out his Instagram. It's uh, JG, uh, what is it, Concrete? Yeah, Concrete. Uh, his information can be on the description down below. Guys, go show him some love. I mean, he's doing some crazy, crazy stuff. And you guys know my nephew, his son was working for us too. He booked it on us as well, but because he got offered an amazing, amazing job, which, you know, big shout out to someone. You know, I have a special video for, coming for you here shortly. But um, yeah, he's gone. So it's been completely just Tina, myself, Aubrey, um, Ace, that we've been just killing it over here, man. But, you know, um, Aubrey is actually taking over all the hatches. She's like full on, you know, an employee here now. And I honestly couldn't be, you know, any happier than having my own daughter working with the stuff. Because, you know, as you guys remember, she's the one that started this whole business. But, um, guys, we have these two clutches that we're going to show you guys. We're going to go over this crazy stuff that we have here. Um, I'll show you guys this real, real quick before we get into it. Look at these beauties. And these are all 100% heck clown. Check this out. Oh man, look how freaking, dude, that looks so freaking awesome. So guys, before we get to these clutches right here, um, I want to show you two clutches that I'm really, really excited um, for them to, you know, like legs. They usually give us really, really big uh, clutches. This right here is the Pastel Batman. Check this out. She was bred to our Cypress Lace Yellow Belly Fire 100% Heck Clown. And then we have this one right here. Remember we call the Lottery Odds. This is a Leopard Pin Desert Ghost Head Pied bred to a leopard desert ghost pied and they're, they're they should be laying like you know pretty you know exact dates get that man some big girls right here which clutch you guys are more excited about the the dg pied stuff or this lace batman stuff i think both of them are going to be really really awesome i can't wait i want to see what's going to have more eggs but comment down below let me know what you guys you know things going to have a bigger clutch i think the pastel batman is going to have the biggest clutch you're going off of that because last year she laid 12 eggs all right Duh, i know steph bro oh. I want the other one. Okay, and the cool thing about the Leopard DG uh, Pied is, you know, she's bred to a Leopard Pinstripe. Pinstripe is much needed on, you know, any DG or Pied stuff because it definitely shows more markings and, you know, that's what I like. I don't really like high white stuff. All right, so let's start off with this real quick. So the pairing to this was a Blackhead Leopard Lavender Hep Pied bred to a Dreamsicle. So of course, everything's gonna be lavender. You know, you know we had a couple of pieds. But um, let's start off with the regular stuff. All these things here are gonna be available. If you guys wanna go check out the Patreon, you know that's where they're gonna be listed. Any money you add onto the Patreon, you're gonna be like a little saving account for you. But um, right here, we have a regular lavender, 100% head pie. Now let me show you the difference between a lavender then adding, you know, blackhead to it. Look at the difference, man, the high white on this thing. And as they get older, they get way more like purple. So, well, obviously lavender. And both these are, you know, this is a lavender head pie. This is a blackhead lavender head pie. Look how beautiful they are, man. And then we hit some dreamsicles. Now, I'm not sure if these are blackheads. You know, I was talking to Justin. And he said as they get older, it's actually easier to tell if they're blackhead uh, dreamsicles. But since they're so, you know, really high white, it's kind of hard to tell. But yeah, we definitely, you know, killed it right here, man. We only made one normal lavender, then we made three blackhead lavender head pies, and we had two dreamsicles. I honestly th think this right here is a blackhead. So you could tell, you know, by the head. Oh, and this looks a little different than that one, a little wider. As you can see, it's just the white, you know, works a lot, you know, deeper on the lavender when they have blackhead. But yeah, this clutch right here, man, is really, really cool. But I just want to show a couple of these because this next clutch is so freaking insane. We had some world's first stuff. I wish it would hit the visual, but we did not get lucky with the visual. So let's get started. All right, this next clutch, man. We're going to go like one by one on this. This was so hard for me to actually ID. I was looking on stuff on Morphmark, and of course, I reached out to a couple of friends, um, Justin Bean the friends, because <laughs> you know he's made a lot of this Wookiee stuff. So this pairing right here was a Fire Cypress Batman bred to a Wookiee Yellow Belly Heck Clown. Now we hit six, five babies, five or six, I think five. Not sure, we'll find out right now. But um, we hit no visual clown, which totally, totally sucks. But the combos that we hit on this were freaking amazing, man. I can't tell you guys how crazy we've been getting hit up by these. Um, now, some of these combos here that are hit are more powerful than probably any visual I've seen out there, you know. So, you know, some of these, I am going to keep one of them, but the rest of them are going to go up for sale. Plus, we have another clutch of that same pairing that are going to be heads that are going to be going up for sale as well. And they're coming from the male Cypress Fire Batman, um, being Cypress's Bondos, being 
allelic, uh, we're not gonna hit no normals here. So, you know, this is pretty cool. So, you guys ready? Let's not even know what you to start off with the most basic one. Guess on this one, let's see. These two would be, oh man, these things are freaking seriously a little. I told you, they're feisty. Oh my gosh. All right. So check this out, guys. So, right here, we have a fire cypress yellow belly head clown. I got this thing. Whoa, whoa, chill out, chill out, bro, chill out. I got that. How cool is this? This thing is so freaking pretty. Let me see. I believe the majority of this clutch right here is females. I want to say this is probably the only male. But again, fire, cypress, yellow belly, 100% head clown. This next one's honestly one of my favorite ones. Um, this thing is so cool. I didn't even know that Wookie and Spot Nose, you know, is a super form as well. I don't know they were a Lelic, but you learn something every day, right? This, for sure, I know it's a female. Right here, we have a Spot Nose Wookie Yellow Belly. 100% head clown. How freaking crazy is this, man? Look at that freaking belly, dude. Oh my gosh, man. This is so freaking nuts. I mean, get it right here. How cool is that? Yep, and that is a female. Again, all these right here are gonna be up for sale. Now let me put this away and let me grab some other cool stuff. And then, yeah, I believe there's only five. Five babies, nope, I lied, there's six babies. So let's start off with, so right here we have a spot nose leopard Wookiee 100% head clown. Now this is pretty cool right here, man. It's basically, you know, like how they call them the head Batmans, but with Wookiee added to it. Again, this being a super form. So it's just like the other one, but without, you know, the yellow belly. But man, that's pretty cool. It's an easy way to, you know, make a uh, a Wookiee Batman. So freaking awesome. And you know, I have these things in my pocket right here, so I'm just gonna be pulling each one of them out. <laughs> so right here, this one's freaking awesome. So right here we have a Leopard Wookiee Cypress uh, Het Clown. And I believe it's, you know, possible. it has a possible fire as well. But you can see the interaction with the, uh, Cypress and Lep or with Wookie, you know, it's pretty freaking awesome, dude. These are the first that ever been made, I believe Cypress and Wookie, and they're 100% head clown. Let me see if male or female, but I'm pretty sure they're females. Yep, look at that. And then we have this one that's pretty awesome as well. Right here we have a Cypress Wookie. So this is Cypress Fire Wookie right here. So you can see the Cypress is way more dominant than the Wookiee is, but you know, they both give a nice little head pattern. You know, the Cypress is actually very blushed out and so is the Wookiee, but you could definitely see that the Cypress took over. But this is a powerhouse right there. Both of these right here are world's first. Cypress, Wookiee, 100% head clowns. Now we still have a chance to make um, a couple of, you know, visual of the Cypress fire, I mean the Cypress Wookiee that I'm, you know, hoping we could hit. But on um, this last one right here, is another one and right here we have a leopard wookie cypress so yeah so the other one was fire sorry then this one is just um leopard wookie cypress how cool is that man oh, definitely got like definitely got lucky with you know these babies and you know what guys i totally messed up sorry this one right here is just a leopard cypress i totally forgot leopard cypress and this right here is a leopard wookie fire cypress got him a little confused but as you can see the head's just more blushed out on this one as well Dang, see these things freaking striking? Freaking crazy. But yeah, guys, all these snakes here are gonna be available and we have another clutch and the incubator that, you know, they just came out. We're just gonna wait for them to shut out so we can show you guys. Um, and again, man, I'll tell you, we're back. We're gonna have babies. We're gonna a lot more babies, a lot more egg cutting for you guys. And as always, we appreciate all the support. Till next time, peace.